happy Monday. I look really tanned. I tanned last night. I used the new Vita mousse, Vita Liberta, because I thought I would mix it up. Just went to the gym this morning, smashed it out on the step. I got up early. I need to work better on getting up early, cramming more into my day, wash my hair so it's looking nice and blonde. And now we are just in London. So we just arrived. I am here with Matt and my brother. We have an exciting few days planned. So I thought it would nice, be nice to bring you guys along. It's actually really nice weather. We came from up north this morning and it was raining. Also, I got my eyebrows done for the first time in ages because I neglected them. And I feel like a new woman. So we're just going to go check into our hotel. We are staying at the Academy. I've wanted to stay here for ages. It recently got renovated and it's a small luxury hotel. As you guys know, I always book my hotels via smallluxuryhotels.com. Not sponsored. Wish it was. Love small luxury hotels. But yeah, that usually means that they're going to be a very good hotel. So let's go check in. Just checked into our room look how comfy that bed is I mean the best thing about this room is that you get the mini bar included so I'm just gonna give you a little bit of a tour the little cloud light -like bed you're in such a good location you're literally like bang in central London Matt's already sat doing work and stolen stuff out of the mini bar hee <laughs> hee loving the marble details and the gold things so yeah you get the mini bar stuff included which is Oh, we're in 44, Matt's trying to figure out the Wi-Fi and I'm turning the wrong room number. So yeah, you've got this gorgeous, gorgeous little bed. And then the bathroom, nice and marble, which is lovely. This is me. I totally ripped this. I'm very upset. I'm going to have to get this fastened up. You can see my tan, so I think we're going to head downstairs because there's like a really nice terrace in the hotel and we will chill there. It's nice, isn't it? It's a little terrace. Oh, where shall we sit? You both just poured it at the exact same time. <laughs> Clearly both thirsty. <laughs> Perfect, thank you. Can you some more plates as well? Yes, yeah. please, thank you. Thank you, enjoy. Thank, thank you. you very much. Come on, this is me, we got bread. Yum. Mm. We're back in the room now. Does anyone else just snack before dinner? Because I tweeted the other day, I'm putting in stories about how bad my bloating is. It's a serious issue. There's a before and after picture on my Twitter. And um, I think I need to eat little and often. So I have to eat before dinner. But anyway, I just had some of this. Milk chocolate by Greens. By Green and Black. See, when I can't speak today, it tastes so good. So I'm just about to crack into the white one now as well. And this comes free in the mini bar and they refill it. How good is that? So I'm just gonna quickly top up my makeup before dinner tonight. So we are heading to a restaurant near King's Cross. Really excited to eat. And I'm not sure what kind of food it is actually, but I booked in my brother Matt and I, and then three of my friends I lived in Canada with are coming for drinks after, so that will be nice. At the moment, I'm using and loving It Cosmetics CC Cream. So good. I find that people rave about products a lot and I need to like use them myself to love them. And I've been mixing this in with my foundation, but today I'm literally, I'm just wearing it completely by itself and the coverage is insane. I don't really need to put any more on, but it's just because I know that I'm going out for dinner. So I'm wearing this because I have not stopped wearing this dress since I got it. I wasn't actually going to keep the red lips, 
but I'm gonna keep the red lips. So we are heading to a place called Bar and Block for dinner. It's actually a steakhouse and it's awkward because I accidentally also booked a steakhouse for tomorrow night. I didn't realize that both of them were steakhouses, but it's fine. They do other stuff as well. They do some fish and some chicken, so we'll see what we fancy. They also do some nice sharing nibbles and cocktails. So yeah, we're in it. I actually love this dress and it finally came back in stock. We're very happy. They do fries seasoned with parmesan and truffle infused oil. Yum! Guys, they bring you popcorn. That's good popcorn. It's like savory popcorn. It's like spicy popcorn. Yum! Gets the brother seal of approval and the M seal of approval. Try Matt. Matt loves trying wine. It's what he does best. <laughs> Thank you. I got your face right in that. <laughs> Trying to multitask. Thanks. Sweet. And cheese and jalapeno. Yeah, thank you so much. So we got cheese and jalapeno dippers. We got some Asian crispy beef, which looks insane. Scallop. And what's this one? Salt and pepper squid. Salt and pepper squid. Oh my God, my brother went for sweet potato fries with feta. Oh my God, is that? Um, ketchup, please. Wow, so sweet potato fries with feta and chorizo, I think. And the sirloin or the ribeye? Sirloin. Sirloin, yum. I went for the beef dripping chips with a fillet and garlic butter on the side. Guys, if you follow me on Instagram stories, you'll know I always order a side of garlic butter. Matt, oh my goodness, he went for the parmesan truffle fries. Truffle fries every time. Every time. We're so stuffed. We cannot stomach the dessert, which is so unlike me. Got my hand up so tight. So unlike me, but none of us can stomach dessert, so we're just going to head to the bar area and some of my friends that I met in Canada, we're just going to have some drinks with them. These are my Canada friends. <laughs> So we're just heading for some breakfast at the Academy Hotel, just heading downstairs. We've got a really nice breakfast area, so I'm excited to have some food. Then I have some meetings for the rest of the day. And then we're having lunch at Ylang Cafe, which is the new one near Oxford Circus, and I'm so excited. It's like a flower heaven. And now I've just brought the boys to Elan Cafe. I don't actually know how you pronounce it, Elan, Elan. Um, well, we all pronounce it Elan. And look, can you see the flowers behind me? It's so beautiful. So this is the new one, which is, it's kind of off Oxford Street. It's called Marketplace. It's literally just behind Oxford Street. And I feel like it's gonna get so busy because it's just so Instagrammable and pretty. So my brother went for the golden latte with turmeric. I went for the matcha. Matt went for a smoothie. Looks good. Matt's not interested because he's on his phone. It's nice, they taste like a milkshake. Oh, so it's a milkshake. Yeah, it's a smoothie, but it tastes like a milkshake. Yummy. How good does this look? Yes. I got set sugar, Matt got eggs. My brother got a big lad plate of laddy stuff. <sighs> So just had a lovely little lunch. I'm nice and full now, although 
I could probably do some more bread. I always want extra bread. So we're just heading over to the Joe Malone townhouse now because they have their kind of Christmas preview event. And I'm so excited. Matt's favorite fragrance is... Orange bitters. Yay. And I have heard on the grapevine that they're bringing it back for this winter. It smells so good. And Matt got the final two bottles, didn't you? I did. It's perfect timing because I'm getting down to like the last half of my last one. <laughs> we'll have to see if Santa Claus gets you on. Oh, we're here. That was quick. So here we are, let's go and see. Look at this. Yeah. How amazing. You don't imagine that they'd have staircases like this, do you? I know, so when you see the townhouses outside, this is what they're like inside. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> How set. This is so cool. I feel like it's Christmas. You guys always comment and ask me where you can get the mini Joe Malone's that I got on an advent calendar last year. And look, you can buy them now. Oh my goodness, this is a game changer. So you can get the candles and then this is a cracker and you basically select what you want to go in the cracker, so your favourite scents and stuff, and then you get this huge cracker, how amazing. And this is Matt's favourite scent, I actually really like it too, and it's back this year. Guys, they have mince pies. I love mince pies. Mini mince pies. Oh my goodness. So I got changed really quickly because it was too warm. She said it's wearing a trench coat. And we popped into Joe Malone. It was amazing. The Christmas collection. Oh my god, the big crack that you can fill with stuff. The fact that they're bringing back orange bitters. Very exciting. Look at the sun behind me. I hope you can see me. I'm now just about to meet Nicole because we are heading into the Mac store. They have like a London Fashion Week kind of pop up. So we just want to go and see what it's about. And also the perfect excuse to catch up with Nicole, who I will introduce you to if you haven't met her, but I feel like you guys might have done. Is she? Yes! Can you even see with the sun? Is she? Is how are you? I'm good, thank you. Oh, oh my god, I am I so sweaty. Stuff. You gotta get the boomerang. Get the boomer. <laughs> I know, but look how nice it is. Oh my goodness. It's so pretty. Oh my goodness, such making candy floss. I love it. Matt, you can actually like the size of your hat. It's way bigger than your hat. <laughs> These are the new lipsticks, and they're like really creamy and don't dry your lips out, but they stay on for so long. Look how nice these shades are, there's 16 new ones. So I just got my makeup done, look how flawless that is. I'm just getting yes. back to habit there. Just getting my lips done and then I'm heading off to an event with Shaw. The boys are coming with me and then we are heading to a dinner at SPK. I'm so excited, it's my favorite restaurant and my brother's finally getting to eat there. So I'm just gonna get my lips done and then we are good to go. Thank you. Thank you so much, that's perfect. Cool. Are we filming? Yes, just a lip. So just like that, I'm back at the hotel. I'm heading out to an event with Short. It's a black and white party. Some people are gonna be in gym kit, but I'm going to this because we've got dinner after. I don't know what to wear for dinner after. I might wear this. I think this is nice for dinner after or not. Because I've got something else in my bag just in case I get changed. Makeup by MAC, wearing the new MAC lipsticks, which feel really nice and soft. So here is the dress, and I will link that below. And then we have dinner at SPK. Let's go. <laughs> So the sweat social was fun. I was there with Shaw. Danielle was there. Oh, there's a cyclist behind me. But I don't think I actually vlogged myself and Danielle. But we got this really cute boomerang. Um, which you can see on my Insta stories if you follow over on that. We're now heading for dinner at SDK, which is one of my favourite restaurants. I need to get changed because this was a black and white theme. The boys are going to SDK. Literally my favourite restaurant and my brother is going to love it. Oh, SD 
SDK. AKA my happy play. Size Phillip. rare fillet. I went for small, that is definitely not small. Fillet medium with garlic butter sauce, obviously. <gasps> Mac and cheese, worth the stomach bloat, guys. Truffle fries, the best things ever with parmesan. Normal fries, broccolini. What steak did you go for? Medium fillet with SDK sauce. He got the medium fillet with SDK sauce. This is his first ever SDK steak. Let's do it! <laughs> the best thing that you'll ever try. He's going for it. He is trying. The best mac and cheese you'll ever have. Yum! Yay! Thank you so much. Good morning guys! Oh my goodness, last night at STK was amazing. Even though it's been like two, three weeks since I got back from Barcelona, don't know why, but this week my voice has decided to go again and I'm still snuffly again. And it's making me very concerned, like what is wrong with me? Just did my makeup with Vici Dome Blend, MAC Lip Liner, MAC on the eyes. Um, and I'm heading for breakfast with Dior, they're having an event, and I'm very excited. I'm wearing this, but I'm actually too small, so you can't see what I'm wearing, which is really embarrassing. Max is asleep, so I'm trying to be quiet. So I'm going to have a nice 10 minutes stomp over to the event, and then the hotel, the academy, have been so nice, and so we can have a late checkout, which is great. So I can go to the event and then come back and get ready for a day of meetings and stuff. So yeah. Let's go. I'm loving this on my eye. It's, it's called Humor Me and it's actually a blush, but I just used it on my eyes. I think it's nice. Yeah, kind of wanted to just show you my outfit, but it was so special and so amazing to take my brother to SCK because I've always wanted to take him and he loved it. And then after, two of my friends came and we caught up and just full of all the happy vibes. And then I saw Danielle. Very, very happy vibes. All right, let's go for breakfast. <laughs> This was an amazing apartment at the top of Oxford Street called Centrepoint and I was there with Dior to celebrate the launch of Joy, their new fragrance and if you would like to move into here it will only cost you £7 million Pounds. The views of London were pretty exceptional. This is, a, <laughs> this is a seven million pound apartment that we are just having a little tour of. Oh wow! How beautiful! So that's, that's really yeah. <laughs> Buenos dias. Sorry, I'm just taking pictures of the beautiful <laughs> fragrances. It was here at the most beautiful apartment right in London. Or the launch of the new perfume. Let's pop back to the hotel to pack this up and look what I got. So we went to the Dior breakfast because it is the launch of the new Dior Joy fragrance. So I want to show you it in here. So here it is. Look at that. How beautiful. And it smells 
really, really good as well, so you guys need to go and smell it. So we are about to check out of this hotel, the Academy Hotel. This bed was so comfy. So the Dior breakfast was really nice. I was with Emily and we just caught up and it was really lovely and had lots of food. Now, one of my meetings cancelled, so we're just having some lunch. I brought the boys to ZZ's. I mean, we had enough food last night at STK, it was amazing, but I've always got room for ZZ's and garlic bread. I don't know why, but my throat is just gone again. That's fun, but we're gonna eat the garlic bread and the olives. That looks amazing. Yum. Also, this is the water we have at home. Yum. The boys went hard. Oh, meatball pasta. No change for me. I always get the pomodoro with a whole wheat pasta. Bon appetit. Hey guys, so my voice is still not the best. I've had a day of meetings. We are now heading for an exciting little event at a tea shop which sounds sounds weird but we all know how much I love tea so I'm going to take you in and along with me So gorgeous. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Ah. Poor is one of the uh, besties for detox or to lose weight. Wow. Because that's what the Chinese people because they have a hen oily food. Yeah. So we're just at TWGT. <laughs> Look how many teas there are. There's over 800 teas. Sorry if you can hear some bells outside. There's over 800 teas on this list. So Matt's only choosing his tea from the 800 based on places that he's visited. <laughs> oh, that's cheating. Guys, <laughs> the chips come with matcha salt. This is amazing. <laughs> Guys, look at this matcha in a matcha bowl with a matcha macaroon. I'm so excited. Thank oh, thank you so much. But incredible. So my brother got a burger and it comes with matcha salt. How amazing. I got scallops with lobster. Matt got, oh my god, this looks so good, the club sandwich. That's the best club sandwich I've seen, I think. The best club sandwich he's seen. I will be having a bite, and we are just in the tea salon. It's actually just in Leicester Square. It's amazing. They brought me my own matcha fries. Just choosing some cake to take away from the cake trolley because we don't have any room in our bellies after that amazing food. And look at these cakes, and they have tea infused in them. This is just amazing. So they have over 800 types of tea. Oh my goodness, we've had the best afternoon ever. So TWG actually stands for the Wellbeing Group, which makes me like this brand even more. We had such lovely food, and then we are just leaving with some desserts to take away. Some tea infused macaroons, even more, as you guys know, I love macaroons. We had amazing tea, amazing food, and if you are in London, you have to come to this place. It's amazing. It's like a traditional kind of tea salon, but it's so luxurious, and the staff are so knowledgeable. They have one in Knightsbridge, they have one in Leicester Square, which is the one we're at now, yeah. and it's just exceptional. My mum just one in all of these countries, me. actually. Um, they have one in all of these countries as well, guys. Um, I don't know if they have the tea salons, but in London at least, so Google them, have a look. Oh yeah, one in Paris, they also stock teas to the Ritz in Paris. I'm just so impressed, the knowledge was amazing, even the boys are blown away. Oops, don't smash things. So we're going to drive to Leeds now. We have a very long, late drive ahead of us, but at least our bellies are full and happy. And I've had the best tea ever also. Even like, look, teapots. If you guys like tea, you're going to love this, because I like tea a lot.
Oh, hey guys, happy Thursday. Yes, it's Thursday, although I woke up this morning convinced it was Friday, nearly had a heart attack, and then got really excited because it means I have an extra day. I feel like this week has been so crazy. So we had the nicest, nicest tea tasting session and dinner last night at TWG. It was amazing. And then we drove home to Leeds. So it took us to drive back to Yorkshire, maybe like four hours last night so we ended up getting back at about 1am we were very tired so i just snoozed all morning this morning and forced myself to have the morning off because rest is so important well-being is important i cancelled my gym classes even though i need the gym right now because my throat's been getting a bit sore again and i am heading to walt disney on sunday in florida if you've got me on Twitter, I've talked about it a little bit, but I haven't talked about it anywhere else. I'm so excited. Comment below if you've ever been to Disney. Send me any tips, tricks. I have no idea. I have never been. I've been to Disney Springs for dinner once. That's it. Very excited. And yes, you guys are going to get a vlog. So if you're into Disney, follow me on Instagram at mshellx because from Sunday and Monday, you will be seeing lots of Disney themed stories. And I'm so excited. So yeah, I think I've just been feeling a bit stressed because I knew that the trip was coming up and then I've got so much to do today and tomorrow although today's already over because i'm vlogging this really late um because i've just been trying to get on top of stuff after my big lion um so i've got loads of stuff to do to get on top of so i am gonna really quickly tidy my room because it's driving me a little bit insane and we can't have fun all the time and it was so nice in london to be with my brother and to treat him and just do nice things and take him to so many of my favorite places so that was fun but now I am tired, so I'm just gonna organize my room. You know what they say, a tidy bedroom is a tidy mind. Don't know how true that is, but I feel like I just can't get on with my work until my bedroom's tidy. And it's so weird because I obviously kind of live in hotels and then I'm here, there and everywhere. I do live out of suitcases. So to you guys, you must be like, why is her bedroom always such a mess? She spends her life tidying her bedroom. But it really is because like, so this week, all week will be in London. I was packed for London and now I'm gonna unpack to repack to go to Florida. So you guys have sent me so many amazing things that I need to pack for Disney. So I've screenshotted so many messages you guys have sent me. So thank you. I'm gonna quickly go into my office and have a look at some stuff that's come because I've not even looked in there yet. And it's just, I don't know why my voice keeps going. I was saying to my mum, I don't know if my body didn't fully fight off the Barcelona call that I had. Also, look how greasy my hair is, need some dry shampoo. Or if my body fought it off and then my immune system was weak and then I caught something else again in London. Well, whatever it is, I need to be well for Disney. So I'm planning on going to the gym tonight, but I'm kind of like, I need to be well. Let's go into the office. in the office it's pitch black already and it's not even that late that is just what happens when the uk turns into winter so let me just quickly show you a few things that have come oh hello you came at the right time for me to go to disney i remember my brother dressing up for a school thing and wearing some of these when we were younger and we used to collect them from mcdonald's does anyone remember that these are rice krispies multi-grain shapes what are these in aid of Rice Krispie multi-grain shapes have received a magical makeover with limited edition Disney packaging to celebrate Mickey's 90th birthday. How very fitting. Okay, this is amazing. I don't know if you guys remember, but I got one of these backpacks and it's one of the nicest backpacks I've ever seen, ever. And this is a laptop case. So this is definitely coming to Disney with me to protect my laptop on the flight. Ooh, what's this? So I got a new hair dryer. GHC Air with Lulu Guinness. Ooh, and 10 pounds of this goes to breast cancer now, which is amazing. And I like GHC for a lot of reasons, but they do so, so, so much for charity, which just makes me love them even more. Funny story, my brother stole one of the GHD hair dryers from me, then Matt stole one, then Matt stole my Dyson hair dryer. And oh, 
my family just clearly love hair dryers. But this is the GHD Air by Lulu Guinness and £10 is donated to breast cancer which is very, very, very good and I just love GHD. Their products are the best. Invisibubble have also brought out some Time to Pink Slim Invisi Bubbles in Pink for Breast Cancer Awareness Month, which is in October, so that is also awesome, awesome. Love it when brands do stuff for charity. Um, you are definitely coming on the plane with me. This works charging. So this works through the best kind of sleep sprays, and this one is their Sleep Power Recharge Mask. A power nap for your skin, love that, play on words. And then a power nap spray, a fast acting natural sleep solution to promote a restorative nap at any time. Oh my goodness, perfect for travel. And on the topic of travel, this from Elemis is for fashion week, but I'm definitely gonna take this to Florida with me. And it's got, if I can turn this around the right way, lots of little minis for travel which I definitely need. I'm actually currently using this eye cream. It is very, very good. Olay and LMS are currently my favorite eye creams. This is amazing, what's this? Ooh, night recovery cream oil. I do love minis. Comment below and let me know if you love minis as well. I'm a little bit addicted to them. It's like everyone knows I'm going away because I also got this travel set from IGK, which is anti-frizz leave-in conditioner. What's this one? Coconut oil gel. You can also use Vita Coco coconut oil on your hair. Someone messaged me asking how to use it. I would recommend lathering your hair with it, going to sleep with it, and then you need to wash a fair few times to get rid of it from your hair, and then your hair will feel amazing. Charcoal detox dry shampoo. And what's this little one? Volumizing spray. So IGK is stocked at Space NK, and their products are amazing if you are into hair care. Din, din, din. Last but certainly not least, this is a London Fashion Week or any kind of Fashion Week survival kit from World Duty Free. I am definitely gonna make sure I go to World Duty Free this time when I'm in the airport because I didn't have time when I went to Barcelona. Maybe treat myself to some new sunglasses. And it comes with lots of little things for Fashion Week or for travel, long lasting makeup setting spray, Urban Decay, Epic. Ico Yoga Waterproof Mascara. I have never used this. We all know how much I love Glam Glow, and these are all brands stocked at Will Duty Free Girl and my absolute favourite. Even just filming that has made my voice and my throat just go a little bit. So I'm gonna go and have a Domino's downstairs. Garlic and herb dip. Yummy. I actually embarrassingly just found this in my bed because I was taking pictures of it in my bed because it's actually national pepperoni pizza day today as I film this, how very fitting, and I've now found it in my bed. So I'm gonna go downstairs, have some more pizza, although I've had a lot today, <laughs> and then I'm gonna go sleep. I don't know if I'm gonna go to the gym, can't decide, probably not the best thing with my throat, but who knows, also this tan went so horrible on my hand, it's gone so nice everywhere else. But I need to reapply the hands next time, maybe just for absolutely nothing on the hands, but at least my nails are nice. Okay guys, so I'm gonna love you and leave you. Sorry that the end of this was really chatty, I just sometimes I very much like having a chat to you guys. Thanks so much for watching as always and I hope you enjoyed coming along to London for a nice little surprise for my brother where we did lots of my favourite things and his favourite things too more importantly. I'm always asked what my favourite thing about my job is and I always say being able to spoil my family and do stuff with my family. It's just so special to like see my family smiling. I'm actually trying to organise something nice for my mum as well in December so watch this space. I just like doing family stuff. Comment below and let me know if you're family orientated too. I'm just like, family are everything. So yeah, goodbye guys. Come say hi on Instagram at mshellx. Time to reserve the voice box, queen chatterbox. Bye guys.